Hello fellow Oxygen fans, I'm Mike and I've recently discovered something really really useful with respect to dynamic taxonomies in Oxygen. Now I'm going to show you what I mean by that because it's a little bit random at this point. I have a an Oxygen page and um, this is an actual template and within this page in WordPress I am storing the category in a custom field. Now that is a a proper post type taxonomy and let me show you in the bats there's that's it in a page but there's another set of post types called portfolio and these are tagged to specific portfolio categories. I've got over a, a thousand products all tagged into groups of categories. Now the challenge I had with Oxygen when I was building this gallery component was that I was using a repeater. Let me go back so I can explain. So th th this is a repeater and the repeater you, you have three options to to populate the WP query and none of those options gave me the ability to provide a dynamic taxonomy filter essentially allowing me to reuse the same oxygen template and apply it to over a thousand products. Obviously if you designed this from a blank sheet you would use a custom field or something which is a gallery component but I inherited the WordPress architecture the build of this site and we had to upgrade it so on this occasion this fix is really useful to save time so if I go back to oxygen now I'm going to show you the the page details template and I'm sure this will come in handy for some people but maybe a bit deep for others. I'm just wait for that cog to do that spinny thing and then I'll show you my layout. Okay so I'm in the repeater now I'm going to show you the options so the query is currently set to custom and the filter is set to one of those categories I showed you railway models gallery if only you could provide a dynamic data into this field uh, I I just don't know if that's possible so what I did was I created a code block I'm going to show you the code block it's quite straightforward and it's really useful and you can use it all over the place when you need it for flexibility I'm I'm getting that category field from custom fields off the, off the page that's running this code and populating it to a session and then I'm setting up a, a um, an action a hook which triggers just before the get posts event occurs and a it, it basically gets filtered through my function so in my search filter function which is kicked off pre get posts I've got the opportunity there to, to get take the query object which is the current query um, and set post type and run my usual arguments for the WP query in and on this occasion that means I'm able to take that session that's been set by the page and filter the repeater so this is essentially now providing the query for this repeater um, and it saved us having to create dozens of pages and it's made it possible for us to make it self-serviceable for the client so we don't have to create new oxygen templates if they add a new category. So anyway, I hope that was helpful to someone and uh, 
thanks for watching